What's up, guys? It is Dammit Bennett. We are back here uh, for another episode of Dammit Noob, our video tutorial series on getting started with Twitch and different things to help improve your stream, as well as uh, kind of find some fun stuff to to make uh, your stream your own. So uh, today we're going to be talking about a brand new feature on Twitch, uh, and that is called auto hosting. Now, auto hosting was announced this week. It is a really neat feature. It's a feature that some bots like DeepBot and uh, Nightbot and Moobot and a lot of the other bots, they all had, but it's really interesting and really pretty awesome to see Twitch actually integrate it into uh, the settings menu. So we're gonna be talking about today. So we're here uh, in our account, we're gonna go over, we're gonna go click on our settings and then we're gonna log in uh, to our channel and videos at the top tab here. And we're gonna scroll down all the way to the bottom. And then we are going to see our host list. Now you wanna have auto hosting turned on. And then in here is all of the channels that we host uh, while we're offline. So uh, this is something that uh, is a pretty neat feature. You can click this and you can add any any one that you want. It searches the whole Twitch uh, directory um, to find uh, different broadcasters that you wanna help support. This is a great way to build community. Uh, hosting other channels and um, going and supporting the people that you like. So I have all of the people that I subscribe to on uh, uh, this here as well as my friends uh, that also stream that we're all working together, you know to, to build the community So this is a great way to do it if you haven't already uh, Adopted uh, the host list here and the auto hosting. I highly recommend it um, You can also auto host uh, Channels similar to yours. You can host by your team uh, So right now I am on the major rager stream team um, and so it will select someone off of that list as well, which is an awesome feature. Um, it really helps build that community. So I would recommend any of you guys to go ahead and add this onto your, um, onto your stream uh, as another way to work and uh, support the streams that you like watching and that you uh, enjoy uh, the company of those people. So uh, highly recommend this. This is a quick video today, nothing too advanced and crazy. But uh, definitely think that this is going to be something that you really like. Basically, what will happen is if you go to your channel um, and we type in this. Uh, I'm currently hosting Angry Iceberg because that's who we just raided after we got done with the stream. Uh, but you'll be able to see on, your, on my channel, uh, currently uh, it says that I'm offline. And now we've popped in and we are here hosting Angry Iceberg. Uh, now you can scroll up. You can see the new layout of the, of the Twitch page with your videos, your followers, your following people, but all your stuff is still down here at the bottom. It's a much better way to see your page. I think they did a great job with it. Um, it took a little bit of time to get used to when it first popped into, into play the other day, uh, but uh, definitely something really neat. So again, it is under your channel and settings uh, and channel and videos setting all the way at the bottom. You will need to activate this little one right here that says auto hosting. Um, you can choose team hosting if you're on a team. You can also host channels that are similar to yours in views. Um, and uh, then you can host priority as well, host channels randomly from the list and host channels on the order that they appear in the list. And once you do all of that, you can hit those that save button and, and you are set. Um, which is pretty cool. So hopefully you guys implement this into your stream. I think it's a great way again uh, to build that community, really get become a part of the people that you want to support directly um, by hosting their, st your, their stream on your channel. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, it would be great if we could get some likes and uh, share this video with some friends. Uh, again, we do stream on Tuesday and Thursday from 9 p.m. Eastern time to about maybe about two in the morning thursdays usually we've been going a little later but i'll be honest with rise of iron coming out we've been playing quite a bit and going uh pretty late haven't got a whole lot of sleep we also stream fridays during the day usually that starts off around 11 and then that goes till at least 6 p.m and then on sunday we normally make a damn it new video uh we may still do that this week this may be that video we'll see but we also stream on sunday too so uh, hopefully you guys all enjoyed this video. Um, if you have questions, hit them up in the comments and we will see you on Twitch.